Hi, I'm Danielle Levine, and I feel honored to represent Bainbridge Elementary School as their Teacher of the Year nominee. Before diving into my background, I wanted to share that I'm not a Cecil native, nor do I currently live here. When asked why Cecil County, the answer is easy. I'm driven by my school, community, and family. My teaching family and students are here, who I lovingly call my kids, as I'm sure many of us do. They are the reason I am here. I feel I was called to this profession at a young age when my love of school began. At four years old, I endured a painful event. My father passed away, causing emotions that were hard to navigate as a young child. While I couldn't identify my emotions, I suffered from serious attachment and abandonment issues. I had difficulty trusting adults and feeling safe. My mom worked at my school and for the following year, I would run out of my classroom and down the hall to find her. While I don't remember how my teacher dealt with this, I do remember how she made me feel. I can tell you she changed my perspective and helped me to learn to love and trust not only her, but school. I felt grounded and safe at school, which I know was created by my teacher's warmth. I can remember how confident and happy I felt in a pivotal time that I did not feel that in myself. Unfortunately, my father succumbed to his personal trials. Therefore, I have vowed to not let my students feel that they are without guidance. This drives me to be the teacher I am today and to mentor children who need help navigating tough emotions. I found that this can best be addressed during the in-between moments. While academic success, confident learners, leadership, and other important skills are developed, teachers must also find the in-between moments that inspire their character and success. How teachers handle conflict, manage emotions, and communicate often are mimicked through our students' actions. Admitting when I'm wrong and justifying my reasoning are simple ways to teach compassion and understanding. They mirror their favorite people. We are their favorite people, and honestly, they are mine. I would be honored to use this platform to promote mental health and self-value. Even though Cecil County is not my true home, it sure feels like it. We are lucky to work in Cecil County, where teachers feel valued and understand that it is our responsibility not only to teach, but lead. It is our obligation to make our students feel safe, secure, and happy in a world that isn't always so, like the times we are approaching now. I feel blessed to be a role model for children, and I'm honored to represent them, my school, and community. My teachers of yesterday molded the teacher I am today, and I strive to inspire the future leaders of tomorrow. Thank you for your time.